Morning, Oliver here from Mansmont Taggart. We're here in the middle of Billingshurst Village in East Street to come see this really lovely Georgian style terrace house. So let's go and have a look around. Okay, just give you a little bit of bearings. We're heading down the hill, just standing outside the house now. And heading down the hill, you can just see Sainsbury's local. That is right in the center of Billingshurst. So you've got all the range of facilities High Street has to offer. Heading up the hill is the A272, but that's recently been bypassed. So it's now the B272, uh, but that will take you on to Hayward Heath, heading east, the A24, Buck Barn, etc. So really super convenient location. You've got a nice view from the front of St. Mary's Church in the middle of the High Street. Uh, so it's a really, really great position. You've got everything you need on your doorstep, quick access to schools and uh, train station as well. Uh, just whilst we're outside, I'll just show you just to the uh, right hand side of the row of terrace, there's a little footpath here. This takes you down the side of just this run of terrace properties to the rear, where there are a block of garages. A garage that comes with this property is the one labelled number four. Now the vendor tells us he regularly parks his car. As you can see, the neighbour has as well in front of the garage. Uh, there's no obstruction there, so that's quite straightforward. Um, he's also managed to get uh, power and light into his garage as well. So there's the garage. All it up, you've actually got use of an old kitchen there, so units and storage at the back. Again, there's just a block of garages here. And if you drive out in this direction, it just takes you onto Rose Hill, which is just a residential cul-de-sac. Similar properties. Just whilst we're outside, this pedestrian gate, which is locked. So a bit of extra security. That just leads to probably three, maybe four of the properties. This one being the one we're coming to see. Again, just gives you an idea. So you've got a nice secure rear passageway. And that is the car park of the local Pets Corner. So you can see how central we are. So really, really great position. There's number 11 we're coming to have a look at, one with the red front door here. We've just got this small run of steps. Let's go and have a look inside. So it's really well presented this property. Immediately as you come in, it's got this entrance hall. So you've got nice seagrass matting that's down. So great for kicking off shoes. Bit of extra storage there and nice shutters which the vendors have installed to some of the windows on the ground floor and door here takes you straight into the sitting room so again this is a nice size room plenty of space as you can see a very large corner sofa and a very large armchair under that lovely bay it's a great room this And you've got those shutters which are really pretty but overlooking that lovely front garden it's a really lovely space the door to the left is for the understairs cupboard and again you can see you've got space for a nice unit there as well and Unusually, this really large opening, so you can see these bifolding doors, which creates the best of both worlds, really. You can shut the space off if, if you wish, or open it up, as you can see at the moment. And that's got a beautiful oak floor that's down into the dining area here, leading into this lovely kitchen. 
really light, bright space. Large French door, which leads out onto the garden. We can just see that hot tub. The kitchen is beautiful. We've got this lovely breakfast bar here. Really pretty kitchen, immaculately presented. So here's the small extension off the rear, which just really increases the space that you've got on offer here in these properties, which aren't small by any means, but just gives you that little bit of extra room on the ground floor. So you've got this really beautiful open plan space. All fitted appliances. Again, nice and bright. So you've got access onto the really low maintenance rear garden. Which I'll take you out in just a moment. So really good standard throughout. Again, wine cooler and things all built in. So that's downstairs. Let's have a wander upstairs. So refitted, got this lovely big walk-in shower, got rid of the bath. That's lovely, really, really nice luxury space. Again, nice flooring that's down. Just like pan around, you can see you've got fitted storage, sink, WC. That just gives you an idea, again, how close we are to the high street. The landing does offer space for a study area as well. So that's really useful for those that are working from home. Bedroom to the rear of the property, really lovely double room. Again, you can see you've got plenty of freestanding furniture here as well. Nice size double bed. And benefit of fitted double cupboard. Just behind the door there. And that's got the rear aspect. Air and cupboard also off the hallway, landing, sorry. Again, that study area. Front bedroom, probably the bigger of the two. It's a really, really good size bed, this. Again, with fitted double cupboard. Got those shutters installed in this room as well, which is lovely. So really well presented throughout. Lovely space. So this one just looks out onto the front. Again, you can see that fitted double cupboard there. And finally, third bedroom, office, whatever you want to use it for. A lot of people would generally use this as an office, but it's a good size single bedroom, so absolutely comfortable single. There's quite a lot of furniture in here, as you can see. Vendors obviously working from home like a lot of people. But again, you've got this big cupboard which runs over the stairs. So it's great for storage. So as I mentioned, really low maintenance rear garden. Really nice space this. Unfortunately, it's just rained. Just had a little shower, so it's a bit wet at the moment. But you can see you've got this nice big deck, ample space for a table and chairs. And then this nice patio, which is like an Indian sandstone. And not the greatest day, but when the sun comes out, I'm sure there's no better place to be than in that hot tub, which is actually sort of recessed into the decking. That's a really, really nice space. You've got power out here as well. Try and give you a rear elevation if I can. So it's hassle free, low maintenance. It's a great space. As I mentioned, you've got a secure gate there, which just leads out onto the alleyway I showed you earlier on, which again, just to give you orientation, so that gate is locked and that leads beyond to the garage that I showed you at the beginning. So that's it, that is 11 East Street. It's a really lovely Georgian Terrace house right in the middle of Billingshurst Village. So it's a great location, walking distance to absolutely everything from here. Uh, so super convenient and in immaculate condition. So we hope you like what you see, but of course, if you have any questions or want to know more, please don't hesitate to give us a call.